Hi. Today I'm going to give you guys an understanding of RSS feeds, what they are, what you do with them, and how they work, that kind of thing. So basically, uh, a lot of websites these days are updated on a fairly regular basis, uh, especially blog sites and news sites. And what something that might happen is, let's say you're online and you've got a few different websites that you like to visit every day on a regular basis. And over time, it's become more and more websites uh, that you like to go to and visit. Now, it'd be quite time consuming, you know, to go to every single website um, that you like to visit every single day just to check to see if they've got uh, new things posted. And you might not want to, or you might not even have the option to subscribe to an email newsletter to see if they have new things to those websites every day. So what somebody came up with is RSS, which stands for uh, really simple syndication, I think. Um, and basically, it lets you uh, just check what's new on all your favorite websites uh, using an RSS reader without having to go to all your favorite websites. So let's say uh, you've got your favorite website and you, you don't want to go there every day to check out what's going on. Uh, you can just load up your RSS reader, uh, which will basically be one central location, and you subscribe to the feeds of all the favorite websites that you have. And that will then become connected to those favorite sites. And instead of going to each individual site, if you go just to your reader, it'll come up with the latest uh, from all of those websites, all in one central location. So when you go to websites and you see something that says subscribe to RSS and it has this logo here um, or you go to this website here on the left here it says RSS feeds subscribe or bookmark if you're in Firefox it's also got a little icon up here that you can click on that basically is an RSS subscription and it allows you to subscribe to the latest updates uh, to all your favorite websites uh, that's a basic understanding of RSS, and I hope that helps to sort of explain the concept of it all. Um, a good RSS reader is a uh, Google Reader, actually. Um, I use that one myself, and it, it allows you to subscribe to all your RSS feeds in one place online, um, and you can log into your Google Reader account from any computer you access on the internet. So even if you're not using your own computer, you can still check out all the newest updates to all your favorite websites. And you do that, you find that website just by doing a search for Google Reader in Google. Um, so I hope that helps you to have a basic understanding of RSS. And whenever you see RSS feed or you see that orange icon uh, that looks kind of like this on different websites, uh, you have a better understanding of what they're talking about. Thanks for watching. Take care.